President Donald Trump announced Monday that he has been taking an anti-malaria drug. 41 NBC's Jatrissa Wooden spoke to a local pharmacist to find out what this drug is and if it could have an impact on patients with the coronavirus. Hydrochloroquine is an anti-malaria drug used on patients with rheumatoid arthritis or lupus. According to President Trump, the drug can help stop the spread of COVID-19. With no proven treatment or cure at the moment, Macon pharmacist Matthew Frazier says there are a number of ongoing clinical trials to see if the drug is effective in fighting off the virus. I don't believe we're writing for it right now, especially not for prophylactic dosing. Frazier explains current lab tests show the anti-malaria drug contains antiviral and anti-inflammatory activity. More of antiviral activity than anti-inflammatory. He says that's why the drug is being looked at under a microscope, because antiviral medicines are used to treat viral infections similar to the coronavirus. Frazier says you cannot get the drug over the counter, and it has to be prescribed by a doctor. The pharmacist tells me he has patients who take the drug and says they are fine, but says the drug can result in serious side effects in people who have heart problems or those with one or more diseases at the same time. Life-threatening arrhythmias, uh, eye, eye problems, and also some GI issues as well. Frazier says, when in doubt, always refer to your doctor. In Macon, Jatrissa Wooten, 41 NBC News. According to a study from New York, the state with the most COVID-19 cases, the drug has limited or no proven benefit for coronavirus patients.